a little overview about um, the Chase Project and the Alliance, um, what we've been working on, the goals of the project, and then later on we'll dive a little deeper because that's our, our part of the project into the examination portal, the, the MOOC, um, and yeah, I hope you enjoy. And Andreas, I leave, I leave the floor up to you for now. Yeah, many thanks, Jan, and, and, and many thanks to Ed you know, for yes. giving us this exciting floor. Uh, it's, I think it's an exceptional location, and I'm really awfully sorry I'm not to be with you uh, in, in, in addition to that in, in my home country. Yeah, but you know, the end of the year is always very busy, I do too. Uh, and it was difficult for me to get organized and therefore also great thanks for you to to join uh, and uh, to let us open the floor to i think a series of interesting presentations tonight and ours will be on this chase blockchain initiative and uh, what it is it about yeah um you see the european logo yeah um, it started out as an EU project, okay, but it's a quite special kind of project which are called blueprints and blueprints have as their vocation to create the one and only authority in Europe to define the future skills needed in particular, normally it started out as industry sectors, yeah? the so-called sector skill alliances, okay. One of the first one was the Automotive Sector Skill Alliance, we were also part of that one, uh, which also had as a vocation to define the key occupational profiles yeah, in the 10 years to come, typically uh, in such highly uh, uh, or, or rapidly developing domains, yeah, driven by IT mostly. Yeah. Uh, why? In order to provide guidelines to the Commission, which kind of qualifications yeah, to uh, to qualification initiatives to trigger, to co-fund, yeah? because we need to empower the people to fulfill the future job goals. Yeah? And likewise, we proposed such.